terrorists are known to target onboard communication systems. The 9-11 hijackers switched off transponders on three of the aircraft they hijacked. MH370's transponder was also switched off. The only reasonable explanation for how the transponder got off is that somebody turned it off intentionally. And, and it's easy to do. The transponder, all you have to do to get the transponder off is turn a switch, and it's off. Another potentially vulnerable communication system on commercial aircraft is known as ACARS. It's located in the electronics bay beneath the passenger cabin. ACARS is the aircraft communications addressing and reporting system. It's a data link between the airplane and the ground. ACARS manages the flight plan and transmits the aircraft's position and performance data. But like the plane's transponder, ACARS can be switched off. If you want to disable it completely, you have to come down here and literally pull the plug out of the wall. The communications log reveals disturbing new evidence. About 25 minutes into the flight, MH370's ACAR system stops working. Its last report was at 107. The next one should have been at 137, but it never came. That's a mystery. I would say that what happened with the transponder, what happened with the ACARs are consistent with somebody making that happen.